Well, stroke's a real problem. There's about 700,000 in the United States every year, and it's a devastating illness and it leaves people markedly debilitated. A stroke uh, is uh, defined as any uh, disaster in the head. <laughs> I know that sounds sort of simple, but, um, and it can be from bleeding or, or from a blockage. Brain does not have long when the blood supply is cut off, and that's the most common type of stroke, is a stroke where there's a clot to the brain and it cuts off the blood supply. Well, it's critical for people to know that, it's, that you have to get to the hospital immediately if you have any symptoms of stroke. And those symptoms would be any uh, you know, uh, paralysis on one side of the body, inability to have sensation on one side of the body, inability to speak, problems with vision, et cetera. So they have to get to the hospital immediately. So it's critical that they you know, dial 911. <laughs>be no treatment in the past the only thing you did was bring the patient to the hospital and then treat them supportively you tried to prevent other strokes try to prevent the stroke that they had from getting bigger but that was it and they were left with a significant disability but now we're able to actively reverse the symptoms of stroke there's been a number of things developed the first thing was um, an enzyme called uh, tissue plasminogen activator or tpa however um, if there's a large clot uh, unfortunately this enzyme cannot achieve high enough um, levels adjacent to the clot to dissolve it uh, in, in time to reestablish the blood flow to save the brain from dying. And consequently, we have to get to that clot, get closer. So another uh, innovation was to develop these very small catheters that we can manipulate up into the brain and put right adjacent to the clot. And then we drip this enzyme directly into the blood vessel adjacent to the clot and uh, we can increase the, the levels 300, 400 times what we can through the peripheral veins and consequently get a much um, higher concentration and a, and a rapid um, dissolution rate or you know, dissolve the clot very quickly, which is very important. We also have uh, mechanical uh, means of removing the clot, something called the Mercy device, which is a mechanical embolus retrieval in uh, cerebral ischemia. And what that means is it's, it's sort of like a corkscrew device. We manipulate this device up into the brain and we engage the clot and then we actually pull it out to reestablish blood flow. It's all about getting the blood flow back to the brain before the brain dies. And these patients are significantly debilitated when they come in. If we get to them in time, we're able to remove that clot and restore normal function. So they're able to, they go from paralyzed to not paralyzed. It's that dramatic. And it happens within minutes of removing the clot. My name is Matthew Burlett. I'm an interventional neuroradiologist at St. Joseph's Hospital. I'm also the chief of radiology and the chief of the Comprehensive Stroke Center. <clears throat> we have a very sophisticated stroke team. We have a Comprehensive Stroke Center here at St. Joseph's Hospital. Well, and the team pushes the patient through the system because it's time sensitive. So as soon as they get here, they're pushed into get, getting, uh, for instance, a CT scan. And we have very sophisticated uh, computerized tomography where, we, where we're determining blood flow of the brain. We actually have CT angiography where we look at the blood vessels. It's a real-time image. It's real-time fluoroscopy. We're looking as we, we go and we do something called road mapping. You can inject the dye and then the computer records that and actually puts it up on the screen so we know that where we can go with the, with the uh, catheters to, to, to the shortest route, the easiest route to get to the clot to remove it. And this equipment is very important for us as far as the quality of the equipment and it's excellent at St. Joe's. It's the top of the line equipment. So that allows us to do our job easier, faster, better, safer.